Hello again. It's January 1st today, so Happy New Year. Um, I'm out and about today. I've got a rough idea what I want to achieve. Um, it's very difficult at the moment, uh, this time of year, to get nice shots, I think. Um, there's nothing on the trees. It's very muddy. There's no growth. Um, and we've got a bit of a, just a grey sky, really, today. Although the sun is peeking through there at Beerhead. Beautiful seeing that. But uh, in my last video, I took a, a shot where um, I got really low down to the ground to do the water to get that reflection of that rock. Um, got a lovely reflection in the water of the, of the sky. Now, what was hard about that is that I just had to hold the camera down. You couldn't see through the viewfinder or um, you know, look at the screen at the back. So I've invested in a field monitor. So what I can now do is I can invert the camera on a tripod. I'll show you that later. And I can now have the field monitor at a height that I can see what I'm shooting. Um, so that should make an interesting scene. What I thought about is, you, you know, when you shoot wide and low, you shoot down. But what I, what I did with that shot was I shot at 70 millimeters with um, my 70 to 300. And I literally just held it above the water. And um, I took loads and loads of shots until one was kind of level and everything. Hence the idea of using a field monitor. Um, so I thought maybe try and find a forest floor and shoot across that forest floor. So I'm going to have a go at that. I'm going to crack on now. It's a bit chilly. I need to get moving again, I think. So let's go on. Right, anyway, I found a, a little bit of woodland. This is really just to show you what I mean by uh, the principle of, of this shooting ground level and how I'm going to approach it. Now, this is my bee free tripod. Now, normally, this is where it's packed up. Normally, you would open it up like that and etc., put it up there. But what I thought about doing, rather than doing that, is having it upside down like this and then just hanging the camera underneath like that now i've got a little scene set up here it's just out of shot here but you'll see the photo in the end i reckon i can put the camera like this there we go and just have it upside down like this. I can rotate it in post, so it's not a problem shooting upside down. What I found is this uh, online on Amazon is this thing called a magic arm. And oh boy, is this going to be useful. So I can just attach it to here, like so. And then just unloosen, unloosen that and I can move it into any position now. I'm going to put it there and what I have here is a field monitor which I can now just attach to there and I can plug it into my HDMI port okay well I've got this set up how I want it now um, so I've got the camera hung below the tripod just above the ground here um, bought this magic arm to hold the monitor as well the idea is that the magic arm really is in future videos when I've got my recording at the back of the screen I've been holding it with my hand but in future I can attach a camera to this and just uh, have it still on the screen it'll be a improvement to my videos I'm always looking to improve my videos so just got this monitor plugged into the HDMI port 
I can see nicely now. I can see how to line everything up. Got my shot set up. I'm on two second timer, as always. And then get the shot. Okay. Well, you know, this is a bit of an experiment. So I'll bring this up. So, well, that's it for this week. Once again, Happy New Year. Until next time, take care.